Speaking about somebody that needed some every respect on his name, TJ Warren. My man, my man, TJ Warren. It's a good thing I did not start recording this episode Monday or Sunday night like I wanted to. TJ Warren started off the I started off in the bubble 53 points. Had a plethora of games of over 35 points. Dagger three against the Los Angeles Lakers on Saturday night. Monday, the Pacers played. Uh, let me let, let me see who they played on my notes. The Pacers played the the Miami Heat, the same Miami Heat team that has Jimmy Butler, the same Jimmy Butler that punked you. I believe it was uh, February of this year. That Jimmy Butler, he punked you, right? You've been going off. You've been going off, TJ. So, so, and then you still got beef. You said, you said that you said you verbatim. You basically, uh, well, I'm paraphrasing. I should say, you basically said that Jimmy's he ain't it. He 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 ain't that guy. Okay, what did you um turn out to do? First, first half, he was on fire. Twelve points, first half. How much did you finish with? 12 points for a whole game? Two for six from three point? Oh, man. What did Jimmy Butler have? 11 boards, 19 points, two steals, about five assists. TJ, man, I wanted to... To talk the to, to talk my ish about you on, on here, but I really can't do that now. I really can't do that. But but TJ TJ, you have a, we have a chance. Me and you have a chance to redeem ourselves. I have a chance to redeem this show, and you have a chance to redeem your hot streak because it is looking like so. So the NBA playoff pictures aren't it's starting to formulate right. The Bucks are gonna play the Orlando Magic. The Nets are gonna play. Uh, well, the, the Raptors are gonna play the Nets. The one and eight seed and the two and seven seed are set. But how should the three and six and the four and five seed be set? I think four and five, and this is for rating purposes only. Four and five, TJ Warren versus Jimmy Butler. It's simple as that. The Miami Heat versus the Indiana Pacers. I think that's gonna be a knockout, drag out fight. I think I think all NBA all NBA fans always want to see seven game series, tough seven game series. Not not the Miami Indiana seven game series where 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 oh no was it Miami Indiana? No, I, yeah, it was Miami Indiana. Not not that not that seven game series where every game was just a blowout in on, on and the home team winning. No, no, we want to see. Knockout dragouts game a series like the Spurs and the Clippers of uh, it was that 2014-2015 series like OKC and OKC and Golden State series like Golden State and Houston the past couple of years series like that we want to see series like that man so Port um Indiana Miami that's going seven for real for real three and six is, I, I don't think it's going seven I think it's going to be a sweep. Boston and I have it right here, written as what's left of the Sixers. The Sixers. No, uh, Joel Embiid said he's gonna. It says that he's gonna come back. He had a little ankle, you know, mess up on Sunday against the Trailblazers. And then you have Ben Simmons, man. I'm praying for Ben Simmons. Hope Ben Simmons has a, a, a fast recovery. We're pulling for you, Ben. Um, he messed up his kneecap. Had to have surgery. I believe it was yesterday he had the surgery. Under, uh, he underwent surgery. And Jim, um, Ben, we're rooting for you. But even at full strength, I think the game, I think the series would have went 6 7, but Boston Celtics are just, they have too much firepower. To me, to me, the best young duo in the NBA, in Jalen Brown and, and Jason Tatum. Marcus Smart, he's grimy, gonna, he's, gonna, he's gonna die for loose balls. 
He's gonna set charges. He's gonna get charges. He's gonna do that stuff. He's gonna do a bunch of those stuff. Die, die for loose balls, all that stuff. I have Boston. And then, like I said, uh, the 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 one and eight is upset already. It's gonna be the Bucks and Orlando, and then two and seven set already. The Raptors and the Nets. That's the East. That, that's that's how I see the playoff picture going on for the East.